Yeah, it's the heat we're going to have to Yeah, you're going to melt this oh. weekend. Yeah. I know. Luckily, I don't have to do the weather outside, at least this weekend, because it's going to be so hot out there. So hopefully you can stay cool or find a cool spot. Seaside was absolutely beautiful. I got to show it off. Look at everyone who was out and about. The sunset, just picture perfect, clear skies. And as we move later into this evening, Currently tonight, we actually have some bonfires out there. Oh, let's go back. Uh, currently 59 degrees this is a live shot. We've got some bonfires out there. People enjoying a beautiful evening. Hopefully you were outside. 72 degrees still in Portland. Currently 73 in Salem. 69 degrees in the Dalles and low 60s in Story and Newport 54. Not a cloud in sight tonight. We're going to see clear skies through this evening. We'll drop about 10 degrees. But this afternoon, we talked out at 91 in Portland, 90 in Vancouver, 86 degrees in Hood River. We got to 93 in the Dalles, Salem, and Corvallis. Topped out at 80, 79 degrees in Tillamook and 78 degrees in Astoria. So warm. We're only going to get warmer as we head further into the weekend. But I want to kind of recap. Look at these afternoon high temperatures. So, of course, the warmest spot, Las Vegas, still going through that heat wave. 113, 112 in Phoenix, 102 in Medford, but 91 degrees in Portland. We are 10 degrees warmer than Seattle. And we're actually warmer than Los Angeles and San Diego. So we are warm up here in the Northwest. Like I said, we're only going to get warmer. The entire West Coast is dealing with heat warnings and advisory. You can see from Arizona, the Mexican border, all the way up to pretty much the Canadian border, say some sort of heat advisory or warning. Here's our heat advisory. We've got Heat advisory tomorrow starting at noon through 9 p.m. Sunday, mid to upper 90s for the area. We have an excessive heat warning for the gorge area, mid 90s to triple digits Saturday through Sunday evening. So if you're going to go hiking, do it early in the morning because temperatures are just going to be so hot. Now, with this first heat wave, could we beat any records? Well, we didn't beat one today, 91 degrees. We didn't get to 97. I think tomorrow we could beat a record of 96. We're going to get to the triple digits for Sunday, possibly even 101, but Monday we are cooling down. I want to go region to region for our forecast. So Saturday, 80s to even 95 degrees on our northern coast for tomorrow, 95 to triple digits for the valley, low to mid 90s for the gorge and central part of the state, 90 to 96. Sunday, even warmer for some spots. Saturday is going to be the warmest out along the coast. 95 to 100 through the valley. Again, the gorge 95 to 100 for Sunday and upper 90s to over triple digits for the central bend Mad Madras area. It's just going to be hot. Here's why we're seeing this. The summer heat continues to build as this ridge builds through Sunday. We get a break on Monday. Some people looking forward to that back to the 80s, Tuesday and Wednesday into the 70s. But it does look like we can see another ridge build by late next week. So here's a look at our forecast for tonight. Temperatures low 60s, a warm evening overnight tomorrow morning. This is when you're going to want to go outside, do your yard work or go bike riding, take the dog for a walk because look at this. Again, 99 degrees. We could be in the 100s. We could be just hot all day long, it looks like, around the region. We are bright red. You can see by the contour on that map, it's going to be hot. And we do get some relief next week, but we got to get through these days. Yeah. Stay cool out there. Yeah, and Monday's going to feel plenty cool at 84. And yeah. don't forget to download the PDX Weather app, and you can update with uh, Claire. She keeps you updated on the app about how hot it's going to get. Thanks, Claire. Yes. <laughs> Still ahead right. tonight.